Hello, this is Live with Lucy Hawkins on BBC World News. I'm Nuala McGovern. Australia, one of the world's most criticised polluters, pledges net zero carbon emissions by 2050. Australia's Prime Minister has defended the plan, which has been heavily criticised. Australians want action on climate change. They're taking action on climate change. But they also want to protect their jobs and their livelihoods. Crowds of protesters remain on the streets at the Sudanese capital Khartoum in defiance of the military rulers who seized power in a coup. Accused of crimes against humanity, misuse of public funds and peddling fake news. Brazil's President Bolsonaro finds out soon if senators are to seek his prosecution. And a special report on how Afghanistan's female judges are now living in fear, hiding from the Taliban fighters they once prosecuted. In the programme, we'll be live in Khartoum, Sao Paulo and Washington. Welcome to the programme. Well, one of the world's most criticised polluters, Australia has formally adopted a target of net zero carbon emissions by 2050. Now, it joins other countries around the world in promising to make the nation carbon neutral by then. The Prime Minister, Scott Morrison, made the long-delayed pledge after bargaining with resistant MPs within his government. 